this is the first time that we are on the first floor and our videographer is on the second floor <laughs> because we just want to show you how high this ceiling is and absolutely how stunning this entire panel is. Hi guys, this is Jervis. This is Manuel. And welcome to an episode of Jenny Unlocked. All right, welcome into this marvelous penthouse unit. This is a 2120 square feet unit with four bedroom and four bathroom. So before you head into this marvelous unit, I want you to take a look at what is happening around us here, right? So to my left, as you can see, this is actually a built-in shoe cabinet that's done by the owner. You can put plenty of your shoes here. And to my right, the gray theme feature wall that is done by the owner with a beautiful light strip at the top that allows you to display your family portrait, right? And as you can see by now, this entire area around me has plenty of display cabinets and that allows use plenty of storage spaces as well and the first thing that you realize about this entire unit is very brightly lit and has a very luxurious feel and the reason behind that is because where I'm standing on right now they are actually marble flooring and the owners have retouched this entire space from old parquet to marble flooring so it gives this entire space a very smooth and a very silky feeling as you're stepping on it right and right above me this is actually a four ceiling that's done by the owners with plenty of spotlights that brightly lit and illuminates this entire space okay so let's head into this main living hall right so this area area here is where the main living hall is at you can see how meticulous the owners are because the ocean blue couch here is actually chosen specially to complement the blue wall that is right behind you right and this entire space here can fit nicely up to six or seven individuals currently now we have a three-seater couch we have a small couch here as well so if you want to put more couch no problem at all and the highlight, right, the highlight of this entire main living hall is actually the feature wall right here. As you can see, this feature wall here doubles up not only as a TV console, but also a display cabinet. LED light strip is actually installed by the owners above. You can put all your ornaments, all your accessories, all your display pieces here to show off to your guests when you're inviting them over, right? And directly linking the main living hall is where the main dining area is at. And as you can see, this dining area here is very beautiful because not only do the owner has a mar have a marble uh, table right here, this place here can fit up to eight individuals and you also have a lazy Susan here as well. And what's even more amazing in this dining area is that there is even more space for you to put plenty of storage spaces here, plenty of cabinets here. They all fit the grey theme, right? And if you look above where I'm standing right now, this is a 5.5 meters ceiling height. And if you take a look at that small area right there, this entire ceiling here, this entire area here, this penthouse looks like a cottage penthouse. It's like a cottage in the sky and it's very hard to come by in Singapore nowadays. Let's take a look at how the balcony looks like. Let's go. Alright, so welcome to my favourite part of this place and that is the balcony. At first glance, you can see how sizable this balcony is and what the owners have done is actually they have retouched the entire balcony area here into black timber wood and as waterproofing layer so if the rain comes in, it's very easily to maintain, right? And this entire area here, as you can see, the owners have green fingers so they planted many plants here but if you're like me, we don't do gardening at all you can put some outdoor furniture here start the day with a cup of coffee end the day with a glass of champagne and what is amazing about this balcony, right? is the water feature there which has a waterfall view and it allows the soothing sound that comes in as you read your papers, right? And what I love about this facing is also the landed facing as well as the southeast facing which means that there's no west sun at all. So don't be afraid of the afternoon sun, alright? Let's take a look at how the kitchen looks like. Let's go. Alright, so heading into this kitchen, you can see that this area here is nicely separated to the main living hall with a nice wooden blindfold door, right? And part of the $250,000 that is spent by the owner, it also goes into this kitchen. You can see that the walls are all retiled with marble-like ceramic tiles and even the floors are all non-slip ceramic tiles as well. Plenty of storage spaces here and all of them fulfills the grey and beige theme that is congruent throughout this entire property, right? And what I really love about this entire kitchen is that this space here is very spacious, very utilizable. There's a designated spot for your fridge, there's a designated spot for your wine cellars, so all the wine lovers out there, this is for you, right? And what is amazing is all these shelves here and all the cabinets here were all installed by the owners and they were all customized by the owners. So the old cabinets were all torn down and the owners actually redid this entire space. And these shelves and 
inner cabinets are all made of bloom system so they are all soft closing as well right and one highlight of this kitchen here is that this kitchen top is something that you will never see because this is stainless steel designed uh, by a very reputable Japanese company and Himo properties and it's extremely durable as well right we have the cooker hood here of Mayer brand a cooker hob here an induction stove here actually and we also have a plenty of sink tops here as well Right? And what I love about this kitchen is actually the yard area behind me. Right? Nowadays, it's very hard to find uh, kitchen areas with yard spaces because apartments are getting small. You even have a space to put your second fridge here. And this is where all the washing and drying happens. You have a drying rack right above me. You have a storage area here, a storeroom here, and even a WC here. Plenty of spaces for you to put plenty of cabinets to store all your laundry items as well. Okay, so before I pass the time on to Emmanuel to show you the rest of this beautiful property, let me share with you where Casafina actually is. Okay, so one thing I absolutely love about Casafina is its location. Uh, this development is a 10-12 minutes walk to the Bedok MRT and Bedok Mall and it's a mere one kilometer from the East Coast Park, giving you that quick access to plenty of greenery. Travelling to town is also really convenient as it is just a 15 minutes drive to Orchard via the ECP and 7 minutes drive to the PIE. There are also six different bus stops, just a two to three minutes walk away. And what's more amazing is that one of the buses that comes here is bus number 12 and 12E, which is a 15 minutes direct bus ride to Bugis Junction. For schools, we have the prestigious Tomasic Junior College that takes five minutes to walk to and Victoria Junior College. Tomasic Primary School and Tomasic Secondary School is a five minutes bus ride away. Also, do take note that it only takes 10 minutes to drive to Jewel Changi Airport. Around Casafina, finding your local hawker favourites is no problem at all as you have the East Coast Lagoon Food Village and along East Coast Road, you have an eatery street with many different cafes where you can enjoy a hearty supper with friends and family. And a little further down the street, you even have the Sigup Fair Price and Sigup Centre where you can easily get your groceries. Alright, thank you so much Jervis. So immediately for the first common bedroom, you'll notice that the owner has installed these nice wooden sliding doors so that it saves a lot of space. And when you come onto the bedroom, you'll notice that it is very very spacious, enough for you to fit your super single and even a queen size bed, okay? So what I love about this entire house are also the grey cabinets which gives you that very very modern vibe, okay? And over here we have the full height wardrobe, enough storage space for your clothes. You even more utilizable space on top and if you move on to the study table, you'll notice that it is tempered glass and you have your electrical pots over there and what's even more amazing are these beautifully textured blinds where you can open it to let more light in or if you prefer a more cooling environment, you can even close it off, okay? And also you have your bedside pots over here so it's very 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 functional. Now let's move on to the common bathroom, let's go. Okay, so this is the common bathroom and the first thing that you'll notice is this grey vanity top where you can have enough space for you to put your toiletries and get ready for work, alright? And another thing you'll realise is that the owner has installed these grey wash towels which gives this entire toilet a very modern and industrial vibe. And after a long day of work, you have your rainfall shower system to take a nice relaxing bath or if you prefer, there's also a handheld shower system for you. Now let's move on to the junior master. Let's go! Alright, so welcome to the junior master bedroom. To my left, you have your display shelves for you to put all of your awards and pictures. And to my right, you have this full length body mirror for you to get ready for work. Further in, you have your ensuite bathroom which I'll show you later. But first, let's check out the sleeping area. Coming on to the sleeping area, you see that you have enough space for you to put your king size bed and walk around. And what I love about this room is that every space is utilizable. So you have your full height wardrobe for you to store your clothes the upper level cabinets to store more items and you even have a very nice spacious study table with your tempered glass tabletop, your electrical pots for you to charge your laptop and also you have your electrical pots for you to use your phone before you sleep. Let me show you the ensuite bathroom. Okay, so for this ensuite bathroom, again you have your vanity basin and you have your cabinets below the basin to put more toiletries as well and you also have a spray system for your toilet and what I love about this toilet is that it, the shower area is just so big, not like the usual ones you get at other condos. Now, let's show you to the upper level. Let's go. Okay, so before we check out the upper level, you notice that this staircase is very beautifully done. The owners have changed the railings to a tempered glass one. And you notice that the parquet flooring is very nicely done as well. And to the back of me, 
you'll notice that the feature wall has enough space for you to put all of your family portraits. Let's move on to the upper level. Okay, so the first thing that you'll notice when you come up the stairs is this additional loft area that the owners have built. It is big enough for you to put your 60-inch television, you have your display shelves for you to display more artifacts, and you see, there's enough space for you to put a massage chair as well, okay? And over here, you have your tempered glass railings which nicely overlooks the living room, and this place is perfect for your day of family board games or even just to play some video games. Now, let me show you the study room. I think you'll love this one. Okay, so this is a study room where you have your beautifully textured flooring and this place is super utilizable as well with your large work table with tempered glass top and to the back, you have your cabinets where you can store all of your books, okay? And the owner has even installed this additional loft bed so that this room can double up as a guest room as well. And what I love is that if you need some fresh air after work, you can just enter through this door to reach a roof garden, okay? Alright, so welcome to the master bedroom. And what's so unique about this house is that this used to be a courtyard space, but the owners have shifted it to make the master bedroom even bigger. But you still have enough space here for a nice little private garden where you can put your potted plants. And this private garden also has your laminated, self-draining wooden flooring, and it is also open air so that your plants can get enough rainwater and sunlight. Now let me show you the sleeping area. Alright, so this master bedroom is absolutely huge. You have enough space here for you to put your master bed, okay? And it has a very, very classy hotel vibe to it with your 5.5 meter ceiling height and a beautiful chandelier to go along with it. And not forgetting your classy propeller fan here as well, alright? And what's so amazing is that almost all of the walls here are lined with utilizable cabinet space, enough space for you to store all of your clothes and items. Now, let me show you into the ensuite bathroom. So for this ensuite bathroom, you have your beautifully done mosaic tiles your vanity basin and the owners have even installed these functional sliding doors for your shower area. Now, let's join Jervis back in the living room. Hey bro, it's been a long day of shoot yeah. and I really love this property. So we've reached the part of what, what do, do we, we like, like about, about this property? property. So bro, what do you like about this property? Personally, I like how functional this whole space is. The owners have made the bedrooms bigger yes. and the study room can also double up as a guest bedroom. It's so amazing, right? Yeah. And as for myself, even though Casafina is a 20-year-old project, mm. right? This unit here doesn't even fit the age at all mm. because it's all brand new. Everything is customized. The kitchen is brand new. There's even a stainless steel top. It's so yeah. amazing, right? And what I really love about this place is actually the balcony as well. It's so sizable and there's even a waterfall view outside. Yeah. It's so crazy, right? Thank you so much for watching yet an episode of the JNE Unlock series. If you love this video, do remember to give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and leave us some positive comments. And if you love this listing, do remember to give our listing manager a call, alright? Thank you so much for watching yet an episode of Jenny. Bye.